Hello everyone. Today I'd like to talk about uh, two cent pieces. I think you'll find this very interesting. This is actually a complete set of two cent pieces. That's all the coin it, coins it takes. This coin was actually first thought of in the early 1800s and it took three times for the coins to actually become existent in 1864. This here is an actual 1864 coin. It's the first year of issue. It's a very short-lived series. Um, the coins were introduced in 1864 and it was the bill was recommended by Solomon P. Chase and this is actually the first coin to have the motto, In God We Trust. Now this here is the 1864 small motto. So I'll put it next to the large motto so you can see the difference between the two. The easiest way to differentiate the two is the small motto has a stem. and the large motto does not. And the stem, when I say that, there's a stem on the leaf. That leaf right there next to the banner and we, there's a stem. And that's the small motto. This one here does not have a stem next to this leaf. So that's the difference between the 64 small motto and large motto. That's the easiest way to differenti differentiate the two. Okay, next we move on to the 65. And this is actually the first coin that has the motto, In God We Trust. And there's two different thoughts on the, the reason for that. This is the 66. And the reason for that was that Solomon P. Chase, the one who introduced it, had, his school had an all matter that was very close to that, that said, In God We Hope. Also, the uh, religious sentiment during the Civil War, when this coin came out, may have also had a lot to do with it. And that was the 67. This is the 68. And these coins are copper. This was actually two cents worth of copper very short-lived series one of the few coins without a figurehead or a representation of liberty on it this is 69 as you can tell I, I like uniform coins I like uniformity in my sets so just about all of these are EF This says 70. I always had a thing for two cent pieces because it's an odd denomination. Most people don't even know that we even had two cent pieces. So it's, it's definitely a set that you can talk about. And the mintages are extremely low and I'm very surprised that the uh, coins are very reasonable for the mintages I mean the uh, this coin I'm about to show you right now the 72 which is the key date to the series next to the 64 small motto 
they're both the key dates. This one is actually the key date. The 64 small motto is a little more common. But this coin is a key date. It's a, probably an AU. It's been cleaned at one time lightly. Um, the mintage on this is 65,000. Which, think about modern day coins. I mean, they're striking billions. So this is an extremely low mintage coin. And that's the key date. This coin right now is probably seven, eight hundred maybe. And the uh, other key date is the small motto. I'll zoom in on that so you can see. And then I'll just show you what they all look like together so that you can get an idea of how I like my uniformity of my sets. It's a nice brown matching set. Nice chocolate. The 64 is a little bit off color, but it's definitely a nice set. They're not uncirculated, so I don't have to worry about touching them too much. I still like to touch them by the edges, which is always how you should touch a coin. Thanks for watching.